here. Let's do this. Uh, so settings. Hello, this is Dark Settle Twenty Four, and I'm back showing you a quick video about how to infinitely vault jump let's get started I've already cleared the start of the vault let me turn it down yeah I've already cleared this part the, the whole entrance to the vault you know I picked up the loot just making sure I didn't forget stuff um, once you're done you go up here, you know, where you go see greed. Um, and I haven't finished clearing it out. This is how we do it. You clear everything like you normally would. But instead of going right after greed, um, you're gonna have to uh, just spawn goblins. And once he's done spawning six goblins and you kill them all, you let him kill your whole party, everyone in there. I'm playing all four, so I don't have to tell anyone what to do. So I'm playing all four of them. Um, just get greed moving here. Um, Damn it. Well, you respawn at checkpoint if you do die. Because that way you can go back in. Um, yeah, if you, your whole party gets wiped out, just respawn at the checkpoint. It'll be like you haven't jumped in. But make sure that your party has been in there before doing all this. Otherwise, the people who haven't spawned in there... Let's say you had three players and a fourth player joins, he won't be able to join after you've played, he or she won't be able to join after you've uh, respawned at the checkpoint because he or she wasn't there. So everyone that has to be vault jumping has to be in the party at the same time. Like yeah, you're all in the, the uh, party. Still 
waiting. Need more time. I like ball jumping. It's like the my best favorite thing to do now. Aside from uh rifting. But I gotta say this is a, a faster way to get death breath than any other. Checkpoint. Thank you for watching.